What they have figured out using the 100 yards of the football field to represent all of geologic time, four and a half billion years, is where exactly on the football field the geologic record shows that events would have taken place. And so they've worked with a little bit of math, they've, they've talked about the events and their significance, and now they're plotting them out to true scale using the football field to represent all of geologic time. Well, I thought it really put things into perspective about how long geologic time really is, how we sort of fit into this fraction of an inch in this whole hundred yard scheme that's really billions and billions of years. Both classes, I think, have seemed to enjoy what they're finding out about geologic time, but also the huge amounts of time that elapsed between events that were so important and how so many events that to us seem in the deep, dark, distant past are all clustered close to the present. Mm. So that's part of the yeah. goal of the exercise. The greatest like leaps in evolution kind of all happened relatively very recently compared to the age of the Earth. Everything was very, very recent in the last 10 yards of the football field.